loud and clear. I don't know if you noticed, but next to Laura was the very phase, um, the amount of things that these Apollo astronauts went through to have the right stuff. With Truly amazing. Just a once in a lifetime experience. I think the only thing that I would say was better than this was uh, the birth of my first child. And, um, you know, I don't, I don't really even know how to explain it. As that rocket is going up and the, and the G forces are going up and the speed is going up and you think that's it, you're gonna stop, but it keeps going up and the sky gets dark and all of a sudden you're floating out of your seat and the, the fasten harness goes off and you're floating. I mean, it's like, uh, it's, it's almost like being in a dream. It's, it's just truly wonderful. I think all of us really don't don't truly understand how connected we are to our planet until we leave it. And looking at it from above, as someone who all my life has always looked up and thought that was the most beautiful sight, I can tell you 100% the most beautiful sight is absolutely our planet. It is huge. It is beautiful, but all I could think about while I was looking at it was my family, my friends, and everyone who is here back home. As soon as I looked at our planet, I had just a single tear running down my face and I didn't even notice. I felt the wetness on my face and I touched it and I realized what was happening. And I, again, it's just, realizing how connected we really are to our planet and how important it is for us to, to take care of what we have here. So I'm very excited to share this experience, especially with Space for Humanity, so that we can get more people up there to have that experience and come back and just share it with the world because I absolutely think so many more people need to have this experience.